Welcome back to Let's Play Quake 2. I'm Burning Dog Face, and this is what happens if you go swimming in lava. There's shit down there. How am I meant to get it? That's clearly not a good idea. Player does a backflip into the lava. Fuck. Hmm. Maybe I can drain the lava somehow. I see. Of course, in real life, that would be extremely hot. Down, please. Odd. Hey guys, the uh the game crashed just there. So uh I guess I have to kill that big guy again. Hmm. I can kill him really fast with this thing. But with this thing. I can, like, duck behind corners and... Alright. Nice combination. I wonder why it crashed. Be good to know if it was, uh... What's the word? Repeatable. It's not stand in there while I check my timer. Yeah. Yeah, that was dumb. I should use like the hyper blaster or something. There you are. Don't mind if I do. What I'm really hoping for is a a button or something that will let me Drain the lava out of that big tank.
Because that would have been incredibly stupid, even if it had worked, because uh, I would have been covered in gouts of hot lava. Oh, for fuck's sake. Hmm. Shame, that. If this button would work again and I could lower it, that would be, that would be just swell. Because I could, like, jump on top of it as it's rising back up and see if I can get up there. Ah, well, let's head to the exit. Bum, 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 bum. Proceed to Security Pyramid. Well, if you insist. Oh yeah, I want to show you guys something. This is what happens when you select quit in this game. This isn't the biggest uh, team in the world. Kind of impressed, to be honest. I mean, you know, I'm, remi I'm reminded back in the 80s you could make a video game with one person. Then things just got complicated. Yeah. So I was just looking at all the names in there, trying to see if I recognized any of them except for uh, John Carmack and, Eight and American McGee. No! Another? While we're at it, I wonder. Okay, yeah, good, that'll do. Save me ammo in the future. Oh, fuck. Sorry about your arm. I hope you weren't too uh, attached to it. He doesn't have elevator privileges. I'm a VIP, of course. I'm the protagonist. Fuck! Enforcer. Ah. Uh, dicks. No, you don't. 
Thank you for cooperating. Father saving? Yeah, we do. Oh, I don't want to drop down. I don't know if there's any way back up. I do see health down there, but... Eat several dicks, you piece of shit. And one to grow on. The purpose of staying up here was to keep uh, that guy from getting a perfect shot at you. Oh, sorry, I thought you were one of those other guys. The gunners, as opposed to the enforcers. Where the fuck did you even come from? Hey, I can take out those fuckers with the, uh, the Hyper Blaster, maybe. Okay. Oh. Oh! Those are the two guys I just took out. The gunner is up there. Fair enough. God, about the stupid key. I am loading. Because I kind of wasted one of these health kits over here. I'm only one hit point off of being full right now, so I don't want to use up one of those like 20 health kits on that. Okay, now where the fuck am I supposed to go? Uh, back up there. Er, no, not this way. No, I don't want to have to go all the way back around. Oh yeah, I couldn't get through here because of the lasers. Whoa. No, not Willits! Oh. 
He had a kid on the way. You sons of bitches! No, but really, I do like that they put a name on that one. Oops. I am not supposed to be here yet. I'll just, uh... Back up. Back up. Oh! Locate Pyramid Key, then return to the security complex. This is where I'm supposed to be going. That one's for Willits, whoever he is. Delicious. Why did he jib? Since none of those guys have machine guns. Look at that. A backpack. Maybe the bandolier is the, uh, the shield thing and I could already carry 250? I've just been an idiot this entire time? That did increase the amount of ammo I could carry. Burning Dog fans explains that one to me because it's, uh... I'm a clueless. I wish I put an epilepsy warning on this episode. I've only ever felt the need to actually put an epilepsy warning on one video I've made. It was, uh... an episode of... Let's play Condemned Criminal Origins. There was a bit in, uh... the subway station level. Holy shit! Great. Those monsters. How do you like it, huh? <laughs> yeah, there's a bit in the subway station level where, uh... There's an, an overhead light that's, uh, broken. So it flickers. But it didn't feel like a flickering light, you know, like you see in a horror movie. Which is probably the effect they were going for. It was more like... A fucking overhead strobe light? Like, there's no differentiation between light and dark. When I was going over the footage, it's like, it goes from completely lighting up the area to being almost pitch black in one second, so it's just constantly flickering like that. Oh, goodness!
Eat a bowl of dicks, you freak. Of course there are monsters on this planet. That solves two problems. Oh, that was lucky. I'm not even mad. That was a pretty good trap. God, fingers slipped off the keyboard there and couldn't find the uh, wads keys. Who's there? Came in. I'm trying to backtrack. Ah! I knew jumping over this and sparing it would be a good idea. Okay. I'm gonna sketch up to where I was so I don't get confused. Now that that guy's hamburger. I'll, uh. Hmm, that's a shame. Huh. We're supposed to get on top of these. Huh. Tell you what, I'll spare those and, uh. Then go back down to that trap room. Not the right way to go to that thing I was looking at. Okay, 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 that was a mistake. I'll just, uh, do that. So I'm not going there. Where the fuck am I going? I'm gonna pass this health kit here. Okay, so it's in here. Now what would really be funny as if there was a guy in here installing a new floor. Any event. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Quake 2. We're going to continue exploring the guardhouse. And get our hands on that pyramid key. Later!